when we joined the Quality in Schools program in 2000, one of the, uh, the, the first things that we were exposed to was a systems view. Now initially this was a very, uh, what appeared to be a very complicated um, document or statement, but as we, as we began to work through the development of our own systems view, we soon understood uh, its place and its relevance to our organisation. What I find has been of most value to us is that people now understand where they fit in the organisation. They look at the systems view and they can see at a glance what our organisation is about, who it serves, um, our values, our mission, our vision, all of the, the, the components that make up this organisation. The other thing for me particularly has been the, the understanding of where our organisation fits within a bigger system. So we've got the education department as a system, we then see ourselves as a system aligned to that bigger system and further to that we've then gone ahead and we've developed systems within our own system. We've started with a number of classrooms developing their own systems and this has been um, quite a challenging exercise for their teachers um, and also for other key personnel who've assisted in this process. We have a, a student welfare system that um, is quite complex, quite complicated, and that has taken a considerable amount of time to, to develop. What that involved was those people responsible for that particular area of the school, or for that particular process, conducting a very in-depth analysis of that system um, through, a, through a process of self-assessment they were able to very clearly identify the processes involved there within that system and how those processes related to the, to the larger system, the whole school system. So people are understanding that need to, to have big picture thinking and I think that's probably the key to it. If you, if you haven't got that big picture thinking, um, it's very difficult to align yourself to an organisation if you don't know it or if you don't understand it. What we now have through the, the systems map or the systems view is a clear understanding of everyone within the organisation of where they fit and particularly where their responsibilities lie.